stick on my plane, and I will go to um, there. See if it works. There. Okay, so you can imagine that, uh, for example, I could have uh, some, something on the, here on the z-axis to to make something physical for students. So not only uh, the z-axis. You remember z-axis is a vertical one, so it would be something. Uh, more um, it can touch, and the stick is here. And what happens if I just rotate it around the <laughs> axis? So, like, uh, okay, a cylinder. And as I said uh, this morning, I can look at it uh, from the wall, so I can see that it's just made of circles um, because I rotated every point around the axis and. What if I just move uh, point B and make it a bit uh, closer to um, to the axis? What could happen? Okay, so now I have uh, a kind of cone, not all the cone, but still again it's still uh, a stack of circles. Okay, and um, okay, what if I move it? Um, Another way, like uh, maybe maybe from above it would be easier. I will move also a point B. Okay. Yeah, it looks like it's no no more um, something uh, just straight. Okay. But it's still made of lines, so it's very strange, huh? Okay. What what is this shape? We we can start discussion with uh, students and. We can ask them, is it possible to have a kind of core or something like that? So, and I was also thinking, I don't want to do a too long demo, but I was also thinking maybe now we can ask students for a specific type of shape with some constraint, and they could print it. So we can go to the 3D printer, and students can go home with their own shape. So we have uh, the wall around from reality to uh, digital and digital, which is quite better because I can really, yeah, I can really check that it's a line. Okay, it's a line. And um, yes, it's made of circles on the scale, but okay. And then I can go back to the reality. And whatever a shape I want to do, I can imagine it and do it and print it and touch it. So I'm quite happy with, that, with that new workflow. We have that thanks to AR and thanks to uh, the new 3D printers. Okay. Thank you, Mathieu. <laughs>